What you up to today, Jim? Hey, John. Uh, just doing some dyno testing in our new uh, remote dyno room, which this is, this is the best thing ever. So um, we, you know, I've been in dyno rooms for the last 15 years. Uh, you know, regardless of how good the ventilation is, there's always carbon monoxide. And um, by having it here, we're completely separate from the car. We've got two pedals, one for K&M, one for Polaris. So we've got an either vehicle here, I can do all my monitoring, data logging, and uh, remote tuning. So this is the best thing ever. I can't believe we waited this long to, uh, to set this up this way. I had this in mind when we built this building, you know, by having the window here, but it's only been recently that we were able to get everything set up so we can do it. Another cool thing about us doing the, the remote dyno work in here versus inside the car is, you know, when you deal with high horsepower uh, engines, I mean, things happen. We've had clutches fly off the car. We've had um, we've had a couple engines break, and you know, it's like a hand grenade going off in the back, and it's only a matter of time until you know someone gets hurt. So by doing it here, we can we can not worry about the, the carbon monoxide and uh, it's much safer. And having, you know, this set up with all of our, you know, I can do uh, my tuning from here, I can do, uh, I can monitor everything from here. You know, normally I'm used to sitting in the car with my laptop, you know, like this, uh, which, you know, I'm willing to do if I have to, but not when we got this great set up. And this gives you access to both the main line and the dyno jet, correct? Yeah, so if we wanna, <clears throat> excuse me, if we wanna go to the main line dyno, you know, it's basically just another uh, login. You know, so we go. Oh, so now we got the main line uh, from here as well. So we do either either that or remotely, uh, which is a fabulous feature. Kick ass.